Hello again and welcome to the Dine Again. Uh, here's Liza. <laughs> Hi, Liza. Hey, hey, Paul. Our guests tonight are um, a performance group known as Mr. and Mrs. Accident, consisting of uh, David Smith, welcome David, and Harkness, and a third party who is not with us but we'll, we'll hear about. Welcome to the High Rose Diner. In a, uh, I don't know, sort of brief synopsis, you want to describe what your uh, performance act is? Because unfortunately I haven't seen it yet. I've only heard a little bit about it. Well, um, I'm going to show a clip from it in just a second. It's uh -huh. a, we have a three-piece band and a, a computer that plays a few other pieces. Mm -hmm. We have a violinist, a guitar, and vocals. Mm -hmm. And you, you use projection as well, 8 millimeter. Is that correct? Uh, we just use anything that we can. Whatever you get. Whatever seems right. So you like you use visuals in terms of like slide does it projectors. Does each time you, you play a performance, or, or is it consistent? It's is it? just never thought out, and usually oh, really? it doesn't work. The visual part, the music is basically the same. Music okay. is? The same music. Okay. The visuals are sort of improvisational? Or? Yeah, and I work a lot on costume uh -huh. aspect of we have uh, four pieces we're going to view and listen to, and um, are they kind of long, like three to five minutes long or something? Uh, we the first one is a, a live thing that a fellow shot. Uh, we played at the Caravan of Dreams. This Saturday was from the night. show then just last week. That's going to open yeah. from the Caravan. All right, great. And well, the other things are uh, film yeah. clips and some video work that we've done. Mm -hmm. It has nothing to do with the music. <laughs> okay, this is called Anti-Metropolis, Mr. and Mrs. Accident, live last weekend from okay. Caravan of Dreams, and we'll be right back. We'll take you calls. Excuse me. <clears throat> Nasty cough, wasn't it? 
Well, that was good, except I didn't get to hear the first time, so I didn't get the whole picture. Um, I don't know if anybody else heard the first time. <laughs> oh, they heard it on. Yeah. They heard it out there. This is different. We don't have the luxury of uh, being able to watch the monitor with sound. How long have you guys been together as, as Mr. and Mrs. Accident? Well, we've been together for five years. Oh, okay. Accidentally, I don't know but, the first uh, we started doing music about a year ago, I think. Mm -hmm. About a year, a little over a year ago. We recently added a violinist, Tawny Barbie. She's been with us for about three or four months. Mm -hmm. Previous to playing music with David, did, did you play in other bands as well, or is this the first time you've been involved in a performance or something yeah. like that? Yeah. Well, no, this is not my first performance work. Well, I have performance background, but not mm -hmm. singing background. Yeah. What yeah. kind of performance background? Performance is art. Art? Mm -hmm. Living statues and things like that. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Fun stuff. <laughs> yeah. Well, let's listen, uh, listen and watch another one. This one is, is called My Eyes. Mm -hmm. And uh, another one from Mr. and Mrs. Accident. When you perform live, do you uh, ooh, <coughs> play guitar sometimes nice as well? Sometimes yeah. I try. Yeah. Never, so yes. So you basically you switch and play different instruments for different songs? I play uh, some percussion blocks that have mm -hmm. MIDI um, output and uh -huh. a guitar. Uh -huh. Where do you usually it. play when you play live? You've played at Caravan of Dreams? Oh, yeah. Do yeah, you uh, have any other gigs coming started out? Started out at yeah. the Bar of Soap and mm -hmm. worked our way all the way up to. Uh, profit. <laughs> 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 and then, we, and then yeah. we got thrown out of there. Did you? 
No. Yeah. But I still have the pants I threw up in when we played at the caravan because I was so thrilled about being there. So. <laughs> <laughs> um, and we probably we won't play any yet. more gigs. <laughs> no, I don't know. You don't have any more gigs booked at present? Uh, yes, as you did. Okay. We're going to play uh, Sunday uh, next week uh, at, the, at Club Dada. On this a, Sunday? As a matter of fact, the, Hi. The anniversary of the uh, Kennedy assassination. We're going to do an assassination theme night. Oh, I've heard about this. And then the next song theme. that we're doing is our assassination theme song. Oh, okay. What about uh, uh, product people can purchase? I heard that. Do you have a tape out? Yes, we do. Yeah. That's what the audio that we've been playing okay. tonight. Okay. Where they're can people get that? Uh, our tape is called Cornfield Ears, and it's in all the, it's in VVV the underground and records. It's in Metamorphosis, shops, you know. for sure. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I like two Bill's of Records or, yeah, or well, the Record Gallery. Record Gallery, VVV, Metamorphosis. Yeah. Okay. Um, so next Sunday at Club Dada. Right. Yeah. Okay. Next good. Go. Is that a, a group of other performance artists performing that evening nope. as well? Or are you the we only thought thing? it was, but it's just going to be mm. us. So How long of a... to restage the assassination or something just to fill up yeah. the time. I don't know. <laughs> How long is your show normally? Our show normally at this point is about an hour. An hour long. The, the thing you did at Caravan of Dreams, that was a, a grouping of other performance artist groups that mm -hmm. played as well. Who were some of those that played? Uh, Lainey Yarber. Uh, it wasn't actually other musicians. Right, it was we were other the only performance band, artists, band so. uh, per se. Yeah. 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 Or the, the only performance artist on Greg Metz, that had that. You know, yeah. yeah. David well, what was Merkel? Greg's piece like? Greg's was just uh, completely off the cuff. Psychodrama I mean, we, style. We yeah. thought he wasn't going to pull it off until the last second, but that's yeah. kind of his he style. He was back in the dressing know? room writing it during yeah. the piece before his. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> that's, <laughs> that's funny. He, he drove off a cliff. Well, that's what he said he was going to do, actually. <laughs> he about did it. four or five days before that. Well, you remember the guy that so uh, had the slides projected on his head? No, I didn't go. Oh, that's I why I'm asking that. all these questions. Well, Greg said he was going to have slides on his ass. So he, when he stood up to go to his piece, he had little slides taped to, <laughs> oh, to uh, his ass. <laughs> well, it's, it's uh, Vitty Dallas Parade, uh, which you'll be performing this Sunday night at Club Donna. Right. Here we go.
equipment. And it's just been the last couple of years that you That's a really neat piece of music. Yeah. That was really interesting. Mm -hmm. We were just talking about using uh, MIDI guitar. For the viewing audience, what that means is it's a way with, where you play a guitar and it's able to uh, be the instrument with which you control a synthesizer or an electronic artificial sound producing instrument as opposed to the usual application. Which is David the fingers, has just gotten one. The yeah. brain. <laughs> the fingers, the brain. And there's still a bit of that involved in there. When they get that where you can really get wiggly on it and it'll still work good, I'll be pretty happy. I think I'll get one. Yeah. <laughs> what we time do, is it? We use a lot. Uh, we have I'm a, sorry. 751. 751? Mm. We have um, worked with this computer technology, like I was saying, it's enabled us to write and to mm -hmm. be musicians, which we oh, could, could not be otherwise, you know. You don't think uh, so? What about right. now, if you were to like have to give up your computer, do you think you would still, you know, play your guitar and so on? Haven't oh, yeah. you found a sort of a way to be expressive with that, though? I, I mean, still sing. yeah. You don't need a sense. Sort of. <laughs> <laughs> I can still keep trying to sing. How does the computer help you sing? We'd like to work That's on that. That's just weird. It doesn't mm. really. <laughs> Accompaniment. <laughs> well, since it's about seven or eight till, let's go ahead and listen to God Save the Day and, and come back and talk some more right. before, the, before the show's over. Mm -hmm. Once again, Mr. and Mrs. Accident, this is called God Save the Day. Problem. Intense. So that, that was neat. <laughs> Duck Boy. Starring you, Duck Boy? Duck Boy. That was a film, Duck Boy. Not so the song. The okay, film. and you guys did that film for uh, another. Lee Murray and I did, have, did all of the films with the exception of the stuff that was, some of the stuff that's been flashed in. Lee Murray. Lee Murray. I know Lee Murray, I think. He, he has did? an Amiga, doesn't he? Yeah. Uh -huh. Yeah, and he's friends with Bart. Right. They've been over to my studio before, yeah. He's got like an Irishman's beard. Mm -hmm. Looks like a fisherman from the sea. Right. Uh -huh. Nice guy. 
Well, I just got the uh, proverbial one minute signal about 15 or 20 seconds ago, which knocks us down to about 40 or 35. I want to. Seconds. <laughs> seconds, <laughs> that is. <I'm laughs> so bye. So bye, though. No, <laughs> thanks for, for being on. And Remember to go to Club Dada Sunday night to see them. Yeah. Right, this may be our only uh, publicity for this. So. Mm -hmm. Hopefully not. I think Club Dada has it listed. Yeah. I'm pretty sure. We'll talk about it. Mm -hmm. And if you enjoyed what you heard, you can yeah. purchase a audio representation of that at various underground record stores in the area, which you should know if you don't. They're VVV Record Gallery and so on. Uh, it's thanks for cornfield ears. <laughs> cornfield ears. Thanks for watching the High Rise Diner, and we'll see you next week with something else.